Boyata. Yeah, we will come back to that because good child has been just off his line and tried to take him on. Couldn't beat him. Yeah, round two. And just round the ground, boys. Lambton won Edgeworth nil at Lambton Park after 23 minutes. And James Vigili in on goal. Chips it over. Archbold brought Meadow Magic have the lead. And it just had to be James Vigili, didn't it? Back from injury. And now he goes level with Braden Crowley and Joel Wood at the top of the gold boot race. Crowley had or at least tried to, almost got there. Enzor gets it away, finds Bradbury. Magic, here they go again, Smudge. Kandorowski, out the hill, to Rubble Hill, strikes it. And it's a goal by Matty Hurl, when a strike is reflected the goal. Swantop was off his line, and bounced over the head of Swantop into the goal. CT, you mentioned it. Think that hurl will come into this game and sure did. Yeah, look, it's been patient to build up for Magic and they've just been very controlled about the way they've moved through the park. Got plenty of ball players on the park and Hull that time is claiming everything as you say. Can Bradby finish it off? He does! Some brilliant passing finished with a clinical goal. Kale Bradbury scores once again against Rosebud.
plays the options. And off for the squaring ball to Cody Carroll. And now Oxford looking up and bending it towards the back post. And there is Jock Piddington. He has got multiple goals. And it's only round seven. He's in a goal scoring spree at the moment. the ball for Broadmeadow Magic. Stretches his leg and rolls it to his brother James. Who swivels, really put close control from the gym. And then he places it in the top corner. Just superb from James Ajili. Individual Magic and it is 1-1. One, one. That's exactly what Ruben Zatkovich is after.